The world's most powerful atom smasher ever built has been turned on for its second research run. CERN's Large Hadron Collider was fired up after a two-year upgrade as it continues to explore new frontiers in physics. The Collider is already smashing proton beams together at much higher energies than were achieved in its first run. Before, collisions occurred at 8 trillion electron volts, whereas it's now happening at 13 trillion. It means that we can probe uh, to higher energies to produce higher mass particles and also to shorter distances than we've been able to before. So we're taking a step forward in the uh, sensitivity to possible new physics. But what is it and what does it actually do? Situated 100 metres beneath the Franco-Swiss border, the machine is housed on a 17-mile circular track. Beams of high energy are fired around these tunnels just below the speed of light. They're then directed to crash into each other, revealing their internal structures and releasing energy that creates new particles. This time around, those scientists are aiming a little higher. They hope to find evidence of hidden extra dimensions and dark matter. They hope to find evidence of hidden extra dimensions and dark matter. Hidden extra dimensions and dark matter. Antimatter is the mirror image of ordinary matter. However, matter has one charge, and antimatter has the opposite charge. If there was an anti me made out of antimatter, that person in principle could look exactly like me. Same personality quirk, same everything, except, of course, when I decide to shake his hand. At that point, we both would blow ourselves to smithereens in a gigantic nuclear explosion. Your ancestors called it magic, and you call it science. Well, I come from a place where they're one and the same thing. Jarvis, and it turned out you were all fall before me. Boy! Yeah! Boy! post. I'm Hikaru Sulu. And you are a pilot, right? Uh, very much so, sir. I'm, uh, I'm not sure what's wrong here. Is the parking brake on? Uh, no. <laughs> I'll figure it out. I'm just... Have uh... you disengaged the external initial dampener? Ready for warp, sir. Let's punch it. While everything around us is described as matter, anything that has mass and takes up space, dark matter is much harder to detect as it interacts differently. It is thought, however, to keep galaxies intact, but it has never actually been observed as it doesn't absorb, reflect or emit light. 
It's hoped the work conducted with the collider, which will now produce up to 10 times more data, will provide the first clues as to what this massive energy is, and hopefully we'll start getting more answers as to how our universe was created.